Hello YouTube, welcome back to my channel. In today's video I'm just going to do a quick carnivorous plant seedling update and show you what I have growing from seeds this year. Uh, it's been a busy year, there's been lots to um, to maintain there. There's my King Sundew seedlings. They're not even really seedlings anymore. There's my hand behind it there. They're a good three inches tall. I've had to transplant them into their two per pot now. There's a few that are left in here that are still a little bit smaller. Those ones are probably an inch and a half tall. I have got a few Cephalotus seedlings. They're going to be hard to see. But there's one right there in about the dead center of the screen. Right under my, uh, my fingertip. They are getting some morning sun. There's a few more in there. A few more in there. It's so hard to see. It's super bright out. I can't even tell if I'm um, filming it. There it is. So they're starting to get their first leaves in their first pictures. And a few more in there. I'm gonna swing you around here. These containers here are Serencenia. We have Citicina in there. And in there. And these are Flava in here. Open that up so you can see them a little better. They're coming along nicely. Had very good germination rates with them. I was only able to get about 10 seeds from each. And I think about all 10 seeds came up. So that was good. I keep them in these containers with these um, slits in here. I want them to get plenty of air and sun, but I don't want the birds to eat them. So that's my, my method there. Now let's go in the greenhouse and see what seedlings are in there. Alright, so down in there we have some Alice sundews. You can see the little bits of green here. Those are Alice, those are Alice there. These are some Nepenthe seedlings. Now they are not mine, I did not germinate these. I gotta give the credit to Avery there if you happen to see this video. Thanks for the Nepenthe seedlings. So that is a Maxima. That is an Izume. And that is a Jacqueliniae. Uh, these are all Cephalotus seedlings in here. These are my Nepenthe seedlings. I just sowed them yesterday. It's morning in here so the fog's on it's warming up for the day so it's gonna be a little bit foggy I did a video on sowing Nepenthe seeds there in these two trays here and so far nothing that's been about a month now so I'm still hopeful down here these are root cuttings from Drosera Adelaide Here are more root cuttings for Drosera Adelaide. There's my main plants over there. Quite a few of them now. Intermedia. 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 These ones here, again, I did not germinate. Thanks, Avery, for these guys. There's the names there. Oblancillata and Tokiensis. So they're doing well. This is my Utricularia seedling. It's, um... It was doing better, then I put it in too much sun and it cooked, and now I'm starting over again from the roots. These are just some pullings, but they're doing okay. And yeah, so that, I think, is all of my carnivorous plant seedlings. There's a cephalotus there. 
Anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. And if you want to see more videos like this, make sure you subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching.